and to think that this place in two days will be closed down. So guys, we're absolutely devastated. In two days, this place will close down. So as a tribute to London Soccer Dome, we're going to be showing you some of the best techers ballers have produced at this venue. Meanwhile, Bill, this soccer hub tournament with about a thousand kids is about to kick off any minute now. Should we head over to the classroom? Let's go. Right, so let's crack on with this show. There's been a lot of football over the weekend. Bill, I'm gonna put you on the spot, put you under some pressure. I'm gonna give you a fixture and you've got to tell us in less than 10 seconds what you thought about the picture? Well, go on then, sunshine. <laughs> Man U Chelsea. Good game. Um, Man United, they're getting back to their old school style of play. Not giving up, fighting to the end, nicking a goal, Robin Van Persie smashes it home. Ivanovic, cost your team. Denied. Newcastle Spurs. Now, Bill, before you say a word, if you're going to lose a game to anybody, you don't lose to Newcastle. You're spot on, mate. We are totally useless. <laughs> I'm absolutely disgusted. Lamella, Flamella, Gamella, Gamella. Listen, Finish him. You might be being Rabonas into the top bins in your open matches, yeah? But the geese is useless. Can I just say, in last week's show, I absolutely slaughtered Lamella. What does he go and do? He goes and smashes in the best Rabona you'll ever see in yeah, your life. Yeah, but don't worry, Jess, because he didn't let you down. Because then you saw him against Newcastle and he's absolutely dog's poo. And I'm back in the game now, aren't I? You're back in the game. The problem is, Bill, everyone I slaughter, it seems like they watch the football fix and they fix up. Please jump on Soldado for me. <laughs> Go on, just say a couple of words about Soldado. Finish him. Soldado, it's about time you started scoring better. You may or may not make it into this week's slaughter section, but whether or not you do, you're still being slaughtered. Trust me, Jess, that ain't gonna help him. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Bill, last one. Another shock result, Man City West Ham. Did West Ham deserve the win? Talk to us. West, you only got 10 seconds, though. West Ham deserved it. That's three seconds. There you go, mate. Job done. Should we move on to the techers? Move on to the techers. Here's your techers, VTs. Great techers, guys, we love them. Keep them coming into this email address, but in the meantime, talking of techers, these are some of the best techers the London Soccer Dome has ever seen produced by the Ballers Channel. Check this out. Woo! That's it guys, that's some of the last techers you'll ever see produced at this unbelievable facility. Now the FA go on about um, grassroots football and new facilities. This is one of Europe's most leading indoor football facilities and they've sold it um, to build houses over it. So we're devastated and we're totally gutted to be honest. But anyway, let's go on to the slaughter section, Jez. Who is it this week? You've got 30 seconds starting from now. Right, this is gonna be probably the first and only time this ever happens, all right? I'm gonna be slaughtering the same person I slaughtered last time, which is Mario Balotelli. The only reason anybody knows who he is is because he makes so much noise, has so much dramas, so many scandals, that everyone's constantly talking about him. And I'm questioning whether he's actually that dumb or that smart to think I'm such a poor player that the only way I'm gonna be known is if I make a lot of noise. Now, I'm seeing through it, I'm not having it. Marry it, Balotelli, I don't care how many scan. Balotelli, you've just been well and truly slaughtered, fella. I haven't finished yet. <laughs> that was about 45 seconds. <laughs> it's too long, wasn't it? Oh, you went Ramble City. I've got City. a lot to say on it, though, Bill. Ramble City I've with Jez. I've got a lot to say on it. Jez loves a ramble. Because I see through it, Bill. No, no, I see through it. Jez, this ain't a Mario Balotelli <laughs> documentary, <laughs> bruv. <laughs> I see through it. When was the last time he scored a goal? That fluky little finish in the Champions League. 
Go back before that. He's just not, I just think he's terrible. Brendan Rodgers, you're an embarrassment for signing that shambolic player. To be honest, he's my favourite manager, but he has kind of like, I thought he was like the perfect manager until he signed Mario Balotelli. Luis Suarez got him out of jail time and time again. Now there's no Luis Suarez, Brendan Rodgers is getting exposed. I thought we'd moved on from that, to be honest. But I'm not slaughtering Brendan, I'm slaughtering Balotelli. Can you wrap this up? Balotelli, you've just been well and truly slaughtered. Thank you. Right guys, so that's the end of the show. I know it's quite a short one, but um, I hope you enjoyed the techers. Um, cheers, what are you doing? <laughs> wearing them. Listen, you can't film the football fix wearing the CR7 Superfly. Oh, they're so beautiful, aren't they, Bill? Go on. Get, get your legs off my knees. Go on, finish the show. Get, you love it, really. All right, all right. You like it a little bit. <laughs> to be honest, to be honest, if there's any boots that can rest on my knees, then bad. They're nice, aren't they? They are nice. Yeah. They're nice. Anyway, go on. You, you're going to eat lunch in them or what? I'm going I'm to do everything in them. I'm going to take them off. I'm going to take them off. Do everything, yeah? Um, anyway, guys, that's the end of the show. We hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you next Monday on the Football Fix. Mm -hmm.